Hello, this is Mr. Collier, and today we're going to do linear regression in Desmos. So I've got some data uh, just copied and pasted into Desmos. I've got the mean point plotted. I've already got some uh, the axes labeled. So I'm going to do the linear regression line now by clicking on plus here and expression. And when you type in expression, you do Y. Then you do the tilde symbol. You can go down to ABC down here. Click on tilde. So it does, uh, this means, this is the symbol used for regression. Uh, and actually we need Y1, because Y1 is there in our uh, table. M, and then we do X1. It automatically does the subscript. Plus B. So it creates equation. There you go, there you have the equation of the linear regression line now is Y equals negative 0 0.747 X plus 1.4. Five, nine, right? So it gives you a linear regression equation. Um, it gives you the R value. That's uh, the correlation coefficient. So you've got a bunch of useful information right there. You can screenshot it now. It looks ready to go. One more thing that you can do, you can uh, calculate Spearman's on here too. Spearman's correlation coefficient. You can go to uh, this little keyboard, go to functions. Spearman's is down here. So you can click on Spearman's, and you can type in, uh, I believe, just x1, comma, y1. And it'll give you Spearman's, which is 0 0.788. You can compare it to uh, Pearson's, which is 0 0.747. So it's a little bit stronger than the Pearson's.